Hi, this is Mike Uhas with Case IH. I'd like to take a moment here and talk about end of row functionality. End of row allows me the ability to record the same functions that I would perform at the end of every headland. So how am I going to record these functions? Well, first of all, I look for the record symbol right here. It's underneath the armrest pad. Push and hold for two seconds, and I will get a blinking red light, as right here. Now that I have the blinking red light, or if I do not have a Pro 700, I can still see it on the A-pillar up there. Now that I have the blinking light on our Puma and mid-range Magnum tractors, 180 to 225, I need to start the sequence. On the 235 to 340 Magnum and the Steiger, I do not need to push this button. But I'm in a 190 Magnum, so I am going to push it to start the sequence. You're going to hear a beep. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to lower my implement. Okay, and I'm going to put a pause. And putting a pause, all that's doing is, is it's giving me the ability to pause the sequence. So when it automatically does it, it looks for a break in the sequence. So I'm going to unpause, heard the beep, and I'm going to lift my implement. Okay. Now that I've done that, I'm going to hit the record button. What that does, here on my Pro 700, you'll see the sequence has been created. If this were on a tractor without the Pro 700, it would show up as, a, as the same thing on the A-pillar. That's how I record a sequence.